Jeez, what has gotten into you today, Gordon? I dare you to go find something bigger. Yeah, I'm happy to see you too. Greetings and salutations, Dr. Freeman. Did you catch that last fluctuation? It's nothing to worry about. We should harness the remaining photonic energy to ensure resonance control. Double check the Brewster's plate's angles and make sure the superluminescent diodes are protected from optical feedback. Fritz again. What's up, Doc? Ah, Gordon! There you are. Nice of you to finally join us, Doctor. We've just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of a gamble, but we needed the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. Mm. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. Right. Come on, then. I'll walk you down. Greetings, Eli. Morning, Izzy. I trust this morning finds you well. Gordon, good morning. I'm glad you're here. These last minute changes, they're a bit strange to just... Oh, it's about to go critical. Run along, Gordon. We'll be but a moment. By Beckrell's ghost! The radiation level is off the charts. I've got two PhDs and an Ersted medal, yet I find myself doing work best suited for an intern. Please, you do very meaningful work here. Really? Push that button. Walk over here. Push this one. Stand and stare at the screen. Walk back over there. Push another button. Again. Come now, you're overreacting. <sighs> I don't know how much longer I can abide these perfunctory tasks. I need more time for myself. Ha! Huh. Don't kid yourself. You wouldn't know what to do with free time if you even had any. That tears it. I'm going to check with the office upstairs and see how many vacation days I've accrued over the past 25 years. It's high time I took a break from all this. Oh, there you are. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. Ah, here he is. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedure today, Gordon. Yes, yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And potentially the most unstable. Now, as long as we follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that. Although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. I just don't feel... Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. Seems to be in order. All right, Gordon. 
Your suit should keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. Very good. We'll take it from here. Power to stage one emitters in three, two, one. Probably not a problem. Probably. But I'm showing a small discrepancy in... Well, no. It's well with an exceptional balance here. Sustaining sequence. The delivery system for your specimen. Standard insertion. Or non-standard specimen. I never thought I'd see a resonance cascade, let alone create one. By Schrodinger's cat, he's alive. Gordon, thank God for that hazard suit. All the phones are out. I can't reach anyone in the facility. You need to get to the surface and let someone know that we're stranded down here. And for God's sake, keep that suit on until you're in the clear. You hear me? Interesting anterior. I wonder where its stomach is. Any damage to control team. Two. Sector. 